Many of them are doing it in their children's names. Today, several families of the Uvalde victims were in Austin alongside State Senator Roland Gutierrez. This is the fourth time that Gutierrez has presented legislation that aims to protect children from gun violence. As the night team's Lee Waldman reports, today's bill focuses on ammo, gun storage, and the shooters themselves. In Texas, someone is shot to death every two hours. A death by gunshot is now the leading cause of death among Texas children. A week after a massive gun violence prevention rally, families of the Valdi victims are back in Austin alongside State Senator Roland Gutierrez as he presents more gun reform legislation. What they're asking for is at least the very minimum in this state, and it's the minimum which establishes an age restriction, which establishes databases for ammo purchases. Added to that list today are five bills. Senate Bill 1737, ban on expanding bullets. SB 1736, closes gun show loopholes. SB 1740, expands gun storage and safety requirements. SB 1739, life without parole for school shooters. Rosie Giannis Stone, who lost her son Chris during the Santa Fe High School shooting, wrote to Gutierrez about this bill. She says, uh, my son will never get eligibility for life. Why should a school murder? And finally, SB 1738, automatic suspension of law enforcement involved in the shooting of a child, or as Brett Cross calls it, Uzziah's law. I'm so tired of everything being politicized. This isn't a left thing. This isn't a right thing. This is just damn common sense. 41 weeks ago today, Uzziah was killed along with his classmates and teachers. These families are standing together, vowing not to let another child face the same fate. Common sense gun safety solutions. They're not asking for the moon and the stars. Since the start of the session, Gutierrez and several of his colleagues have filed 21 pieces of gun reform legislation for the 21 lives taken at Robb Elementary. The deadline to file new pieces of legislation is this Friday. Back to you.